In this tutorial, we will take a look at some basic key signatures of C, G, D, F major. Key signatures are musical notations that tell us which notes are frequently used in a piece of music. When we write music that mainly uses notes from the C major scale and ends with a C, then we can say that the music is in C major. The key signature of C major contains no sharp or flat, making it the simplest key signature. Let's listen to music in C major. Now let's move on to G major. When we write music that mainly uses notes from the G major scale, that is G, A, B, C, D, E, and F sharp, the piece is then identified as in G major. There is a F sharp in G major scale. Instead of writing all the Fs with sharp signs throughout the piece, we just need to write one sharp at the beginning, right after the clef, to indicate that all Fs should be F sharps. For example, the following music was written in G major, because it starts and ends with G. If the score is presented without key signature, there are so many F sharps throughout the music. With a key signature, it looks so neat like this. Remember that in treble clef, we always write the F sharp sign on the highest line, not the lower spaced one. In the bass clef, we write the F sharp on the fourth line counting from the bottom, Remember, in this example, all Fs should be F sharps, not only the one on the top line in treble clef or the fourth line of the bass clef. Let's listen to some music in G major. Let's move on to D major now. In D major, we encounter two sharps, F sharp and C sharp. The key signature looks like this. Let's listen to some music in D major. Lastly, let's take a look in F major, which has one flat, B flat. The flat is written on the middle line in the treble clef. In the bass clef, the flat is written on the second line from the bottom. If a piece of music was written with notes mainly from the F major scale, which are F, G, A, B flat, C, D, E, F, the piece is in F major. Let's listen to some music in F major. Key signatures play a vital role in determining the overall mood and character of a piece. Each major key has its unique flavor, adding variety and interest to the musical landscape. So next time you listen to or play music, pay attention to the key signature, and you'll gain a deeper appreciation for the artistry behind it. That's all for this episode. See you until next time.